Hey Dandelions, it's me Sandy, aka Sandy Dandy. And I'm in my pajamas. I just got done running Aaron, uh, an errand I had to run, and I went to McDonald's and I got a Big Mac, and me and Max already ate that, so yeah, Big Mac and fries. So today, um, I have a movie from Netflix uh, DVD. And I'm not going to show you the other side because it has my address. But, um, yeah, I love the picture there. It says 1998 and 2023. So it's got the people uh, getting the DVDs out of the mailbox. So let's open this up. And I think I know which, like I always say, I think I know which one it is. But sometimes... Um, things uh get on a wait list sometimes they just don't have that dvd uh it's like they have a limited amount of that dvd and it's not in so yeah so let's see uh okay share your 1999 photo to win okay so there's another contest and see uh you're supposed to make a pit uh see here our 24th our 25th anniversary has got us feeling nostalgic man help us celebrate by sharing a photo of yourself from 1998 or as close as possible if you were born before you were Okay, and you're just supposed to show a picture of yourself from 1998. And, yeah, I have some around here someplace, but, uh, yeah, I wouldn't know right off where the picture of myself from 1998 was. So, yeah. So, let's see what I got. Uh, it's Downton Abbey, A New Era. This is the second Downton Abbey movie, and I have not watched it yet. I have watched, uh... The complete series and the first movie. Um, I own the first movie, but I hadn't seen the second, and I decided to rent it first before I spent the money on it. I love Downton Abbey, but um, yeah, I just wanted to watch it first, uh, rental, and then uh, decide if I want to buy it. So there is the DVD. It's just uh, it's like a gold. It's gold. It's not really yellow and it's it's kind of gold and it's just plain with the uh, saying Downton Abbey new area new era and yeah so I got that and I've been wanting to see it for a while um, let's see it came out in 2022 but um like I told you guys many times we do not have a movie theater uh, the closest one is in Glasgow and Glasgow is like a good about I'd say about 10 15 miles from where I live and yeah um, I told you guys we do have a library but um, the library from my house it's like to the very end of town so that's why I don't go to the library that much because um yeah, it's on the other side of town. And, uh, yeah, fun fact, our library is next door to a funeral home. So, yeah, fun times. Uh, so, I don't get to go to the li I don't get to go to my library that often because, uh, yeah, like I said, it is on the far side, almost, it's at the end of town, and... I uh, just haven't been there in a while, and if I do ever go back to the library, I probably have to get a new um, library card because, uh, yeah. Did I have schmuss on my face? Because um, I have not been to the library, and it's been a long time, so I probably have to get a new library card. So, yeah. But, yeah. Right now, I'm just doing a Netflix DVD for a while. And yesterday was my last day with uh, with Netflix uh, streaming service. And, oh yeah, guys, today's my birthday. 
So, yeah, we're not gonna... Yeah, you guys can guess how old I am. Um, and I'll tell you if you're correct. Because I don't look my age. And I was born in January 19th, 1979. So, yeah, do the math and you'll figure out how old I am. But I don't look as old as I am. So, yeah. So, I'm just relaxing today. I'm gonna... Uh, do some more coloring in my uh, adult coloring book and um, yeah my journal this is my journal it's journal combination glue book um, junk journal and yeah so that's what I do every every day um, yeah I got some more stuff to put in there today so yeah, I do my journal every day, and I've decided, you know, um, yeah, everybody, like, does their own journaling in their own way. Okay, and I gotta wipe my nose, so we're gonna go behind the journal to do that. And this is just, um, a regular three-ring binder, and this, uh, picture here is from, um, a magazine, and I, I just love that picture. It's like a pinball machine. And the back has another picture from a magazine. I love that. I like the old typewriter. And I'll do a flip through of this one. I'm not going to do a flip through of uh, my journal from last year because uh, because I'm just, it's still raw to um, go through that journal because uh, that's the journal that I was writing in when my mom died. So um, I put that away in a box. And someday I'll go back through it and I may do a flip through and show you guys that one. But right now it's raw and I just, yeah, I can't go through it right now. So, yeah. And I love this. Um, I decided to do a binder. And, yeah, I have all my cutouts. Well, this is not all the cutouts. Yeah, you, I need to or reorganize all my stuff for magazines that I cut out. And yeah, so I just put the things I'm gonna use right away in here, and I'll, sh I'll I will do a flip through of this one when I get done with it. And today I got a magazine in the mail. Did you guys hear about Lisa Marie dying? And that was like uh, that was like shocking because she was not that old. And uh, there's Austin Butler. Austin Butler, I couldn't think of his name when I uh, wa was watching the Elvis movie until after I watched it, um, after I did the video about it. So his name is Austin Butler, and he was a really, he was really good as Elvis. So, yeah. So I will be uh, going through that. I'm going to do a magazine harvest off screen. Um, yeah, I know people, like, do those harvesting videos where they uh, show you as they're going through the magazine. But, um, yeah, um, I'm kind of clumsy, so I don't know if I could uh, cut things out of a magazine and talk to you guys at the same time. Because, uh, yeah, I like my fingers, and I'm afraid I would cut a digit off. So, yeah. And, uh... Not much more to tell you guys. I'm um, doing pretty good. Uh, like I told you guys before, I have my ups and I have my downs. But I'm still hanging in there, guys. So, oh yeah, and I have my comfort item. Yeah, do not laugh. Hey, if you're haters, don't leave a comment. Because you'll go away. But this is my comfort item. And this, yeah, don't make fun of me. I have a comfort item that I sleep with, and uh, he's on the couch right now. And I, yeah, when I'm not feeling good, I like to hold on to him. He had a mask. Uh, she, she, I call, I call her Maxine because of Max over there. Uh, she had a mask on, and I took the mask off uh, for Halloween. And you can see her, her little bones. 
And she looks kind of like Max's mother. So that's why his, we call her his bio mother. Um, yeah, because he's like my, he's my little fur brother. So, and companion. But yes, I love my little Maxine here. I love her uh, bones. And they did not have any of these um, like little stuffed animal things this year at Walmart. So, yeah, I am not going to, I'm going to take very good care of her. The first time I put her in the washer, I was afraid that she was going to fall apart. But, yeah, she's made it through a couple washings. And, yeah. And, excuse my hair if it looks like like uh, I've stuck my head in a dryer. Uh, the wind, we were having strong wind advisory right now. And, uh, yeah, my hair's been all over the place today. And we had a really bad storm last night. It sounded like I was in the middle of a waterfall. So, yeah. And I was having... Uh, yeah, if you guys didn't know, I have arthritis, so I was having a lot of arthritis pain. And I'm going to be also working in uh, my uh, 400 writing props. And I colored in the uh, cover, the ink pen, the quill, or whatever you call it. I had one of those uh, when I took art class. So, yeah. So, I colored that in, and I did that like a little bit. Yeah, that like left a little spot over there, but who cares? So I'm going to do that today. And let me put that down here. And I'm going to let you guys go. And I'll see you guys in my next video. I love you guys. Take care.